Welcome Scorpio to your weekly love reading for April 16th to the 22nd of 2018. Alright, so we're going to do a five card spread for you. And it's going to be your overall energy, um, your partner, what they might be bringing towards you if you're dealing with somebody, or just energy in general that might be coming towards you, your response, the advice, and then the outcome for the week. Alright, so energies for Scorpio, I love for April 16th to the 22nd of 2018. Overall energy is the nine of cups. There's bliss. There's happiness. There's content. You may be um, happy about either someone emotionally getting something that you want, seeing signs of something that you want, or this could be materially as well. It could be money, but emotionally you're happy about something. You might be pleased about something. So feeling good, right? Sometimes this is different romantic partners. Sometimes it's the person that you want, that specific romantic partner but something is good now the person that you are dealing with but they're bringing towards you it could be bringing a baby towards you it could be bringing a child um invitation to hang out to go on a date to come to a party engagement literally um having fun you know joy a lot of playfulness in a new beginning a new relationship so this could be a water sign pisces scorpio or cancer a younger person um but energy of playfulness um creativity even singing with this person being creative with them something good um maybe even a very spiritual psychic connection that you have with this person that could be very pleasing to you right um now your response is the five of wands so <laughs> Even though some good things are going on, right? You may be conflictual about whether or not this is too good to be true. Whether or not this is something that you want to move forward with. You're kind of stuck maybe again in the past. And you may be stuck in with a newer option for some of you out there. Sometimes these are little petty things that could be going on. Maybe in the home, uh, in your relationship with maybe two different romantic partners for some. Um, but there is some kind of squabbles and things like that going on. Literally sometimes confrontation. And sometimes when I see these combinations, it's like some of you may just want to rile your partner up just to get a... a a kick out of it you know to kind of laugh about it later to kind of keep the relationship kind of going but you know just be careful with um purposely trying to stress someone out or allowing someone to get you riled up for no reason all right now your advice is the two of cups you have a soulmate energy maybe even a just a regular romantic relationship some of you are dating getting to know someone but there are some lessons that you may have with this particular person it could be another water sign pisces scorpio or cancer um but there is some kind of chemistry there with you and somebody and then the outcome king of cups you got some really good cards now this is a pisces scorpio or cancer but i feel like this is an energy of you being sensitive um being caring and nurturing those that you might be around in the home environment or just uh intuitively aware that someone has deep feelings for you male or female all right um and it doesn't have to be that sign it could be any other sign so let's clarify the page of cups for your the person that might be bringing the energy towards the page of cups scorpio go by the page of cups now you have the ten of cups in reverse and that person this is like a relationship that's brewing it's starting right this combination and it's not quite there just yet you two haven't moved in yet you haven't really spent a lot of time with one another but you are around one another maybe at a gathering at parties at events um cookouts um, social events things like that but the happiness and completion is not there just yet for some of you out there um clarify the five of wands for your response click out of five of wands for scorpio there are issues with the past um i just mentioned that issues with closure with clarity about unfinished business about things that you have done but the other person have has done and maybe you are uh, constantly like in literally sometimes physical altercation with that person or just uh, in com competing mode or uh, competition with someone um where you're trying to keep someone away or someone is trying to keep you away and different things like that could be going on and let's clarify the uh, king of cups for scorpio king of cups. 
yes, you may be overwhelmed. You may be uh, in tense situations where there's a lot of different people or opportunities that may be coming your way. Even if you feel like you can't find the clarity that you need, you feel like giving up. You just want to let go and just kind of do you. Focus on the things and the people that might be around you that does uh, bring some pleasant um, experiences to you. And um, sometimes you could be thinking about a um, particular person and if you can't get them to come to you and if you feel like they're moving away you may just kind of let them be let them do their thing it depends on who that might be it doesn't have to be a water sign it could be anyone but there's some good energy here i feel like there are some complications with you and somebody um you two may not literally be together just yet but there are some issues around um children a baby or um, even a love relationship i feel so let's see messages for from archangel michael for Scorpio for April 16th to the 22nd of 2018. We have let go of fear now and it says Archangel Michael please help me feel safe and deserving of your guidance. Thank you for clearing me of heavy toxic or ego based thoughts or feelings. Um, that's the response that you might give out every now and then. Sometimes this could be anger management. Sometimes this could be fear of not getting the person or the uh, relationship or outcome that you want. Sometimes this is fear of conflict that you may be involved in if it does deal with um, a few different people that are showing up here. It could be a marriage as well for some of you out there. And you could be overwhelmed with that particular situation, a divorce, um, a separation from a relationship, things like that. But anything that could be holding you back, any kind of fear that you have in doubt of moving on of letting go or even starting over in a new relationship so um try to conquer that all right so that's going to be your reading for the week i do hope that the messages did help you out make sure that if you would like to you can always go to the website psychiclovehills.com schedule something personally for your energy as these are general all right so have a good one